Hi everyone, I'm Walter. And I'm Sam. And welcome to Unit 6, a Big Time Socialists. So, according to American politicians, K-pop stands are a danger to society. Hmm. However, those old out-of-touch fools don't know what they're talking <laughs> about. Stan. Stan. Out of touch. Out of touch. Most old people like to blame young people for listening to, uh, I guess, not good music, bad music, out of touch music. But it turns out the, uh, the Trump supporters in this situation say that the antagon antagonism is mutual. Antagonism. Antagonism. In recent months, the, what's it, apolitical mm. uh, group of K-pop fans have mobilized in a series of targeted pranks. Mm. Um, so there is a been, there's been a congressional candidate that's actually come out and say that BTS actually stands for, um, was it Big Time, Time Socialist? Mobilize. Mobilize. Prank. Prank. As a lot of these fans that have been involved in politics have mm. been BTS fans, mm. and there was a, you know, the most recent case being the fans actually um, kind of grouping together mm. and targeting Trump at his rally in Oklahoma where they bought out most of the tickets. Um, and that was supposed to be his return, you know, his campaign, the return to his campaign trail. Campaign trail. Campaign trail. Talking a little bit more about music, who is your favorite artist of all time? If there's only one person or one group you could say is the your favorite of all time, who do you think it would be? I, I want to just put this down to them being the most influential, mm. and that would probably be Linkin Park. Okay, for you. Um, yep. For me, because I mean, that was when I was in my angsty teenage years. Yep. Um, but they kind of really brought me into the world of rock, mm -hmm. which, and also hip hop at the same time. It was mm -hmm. really kind of a age of discovery. So yeah, yeah. They, they were my favorite of all time. They're yeah. under the new metal genre. Yes, yeah. yeah. What about you? Yeah. That is also a very good question. I do have. Uh, like, I have favorite bands and I have favorite artists. Mm -hmm. However, if I were to say um, overall, oh, geez, it's so hard. I'm also a big rock fan, and mm -hmm. I guess they're not very popular in Korea, so not many people may have heard of them. But Foo Fighters. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah big yeah. one. Yeah, yeah, they're huge. Uh, Dave Grohl, who is the, the lead singer of Foo Fighters, and for some people who know, uh, the dr ex drummer for Nirvana. Right, right, yeah. Um, his influence on rock culture has really changed uh, the world, I believe. Now, we're both on social media. Mm -hmm. If there's an opportunity for you to post something about Linkin Park, for instance, do you ever post about them? No, but I have once. Okay. Um, and that was unfortunately when the lead singer took his life. Right, right, right. I believe it's one of my first posts on my account. I'm yeah, not yeah, sure yeah. if it's still there. Back in mm. 2017. Yeah, it wasn't too long ago. I right? mean, you know, we hear about celebrity deaths, and I remember, oh yeah, I remember that 2016 was being, it was infamous in the UK mm. for being like the year of death yeah, for yeah, celebrities yeah. singers. I think like Bowie died at the beginning. Was Amy Winehouse the same year? No, she was she was quite a bit before, but oh, okay. I remember like Bowie, there was a bunch of UK celebrities. Yeah, yeah. Actors who played Professor Snape. What about you? Um, not really. I guess uh, I, I don't really post too much on my face. Book. Oh, yeah, don't look um, at it. Yeah, there's a lot of embarrassing posts. Right, right. Uh, Instagram, not really. Uh, I try to keep my music and my, my social media separately. I think most people know my music taste anyway. Mm -hmm. So it's not a big, it's not really a big importance to me anyway. Right. Anyway, that wraps it up for the preview section, and we'll see you on the review section.